Good morning everyone, Dashing Dink here. Peak pay. Is it really worth it? Is it good? Is it bad? Can you make money with peak pay? We're going to try and answer this question today. We'll see what happens. We've got $2 peak pay until 10 o'clock this morning. So I'm just getting ready to turn on the app. We're going to see what happens. I'm in a pretty small market. I think there's a lot of dashers that try to take advantage of the peak pay. All right, we got our first order during peak pay and $6 to go 3.4 miles from Country Kitchen. Now, you gotta remember, we got $2 peak pay. So this would have been a $4 order to go 3.4 miles. Not the greatest, still over a buck a mile, but now it qualifies as a high pay order. I've got a screenshot, you'll see it in the video. Let's go get it. All right, we got Peter's food and hot bag in the back. Again, the sun's just coming up, so it is one degree, one degree Fahrenheit in Bemidji, Minnesota right now. Welcome to winter, welcome to the cold, and welcome to the snow. Whoo, dashing in the cold, man. Let's get this peak pay. Okay, so I came to the south end of town. I'm sitting in a parking lot. I've got Duncan right over here. I've got a few other places behind me. Uh, so we've got $2 peak pay going on right now until 10 o'clock. I have so far seen two other door dashers out. We've only gotten the one order from Country Kitchen. And now I'm setting. When I first started, it said that it was very busy in town, but it is not very busy anymore. <laughs> so, I don't know if my strategy should be to set here, to set on the north end, or to drive around a little bit to see if something pops up, but that's what we're gonna find out today. Is peak pay really worth it? I think it brings out more door dashers. I think it brings out door dashers that maybe haven't dashed in a long time. And so we're gonna find out if we continue to get orders, if it stays busy, if it stays steady, and if the money is worth the peak pay. Should we chase it? Should we not? We'll find that out. Finally got another offer, $7 to go, I think it's 2.4 miles. Uh, we're going to Hardee's. I don't think since I started doing these videos we've had an offer from Hardee's yet, so. We're gonna head over to Hardee's, we're gonna get this, seven bucks, it was five bucks originally, I probably would have taken it, 2.7 miles. It's almost two bucks a mile, but now it's almost three. So we'll head over to Hardy's. DoorDash order for Andrew. Okay, we got Andrew's uh, Hardee's picked up. Uh, looks like this is going 1.4 miles, so yeah. When we got it, we were kind of on the south end of town, so it said like 2.4. Got up here to the north end, hit Hardee's, now we're heading back to uh, Andrew's house. See you there. Okay. Andrew, I want to thank you for your business. I appreciate it. I hope that you enjoy your hearties and have a wonderful day. 
All right, we just accepted a 550 going 2.3 miles from Duncan. Not a good order. I mean, obviously we got the $2 peak pay, so it makes it a better order, but this would have been 350 for 2.3 miles. So I took it because I'd rather be busy than set. All right, guys, this actually worked out because they just stacked us with an 850 plus for an additional like 2.3 or 2.8 miles, something like that, from Duncan. So we just turned this from a 550 into a $13 plus order. So here we go. Good morning. What's the name? I won't get your faces. I got both Cassie and Chelsea. Nice. That's everything? That's All right, thank you, you guys. Have a good day. All right, we've got Cassie and Chelsea's order in the hot bag in the back. Um, this first one's only going a half a mile, so. Okay, so this first one I think is going to my insurance agent. <laughs> <laughs> which is actually pretty funny um, I've delivered to her many times over the years and um, I think this one's going there too so we'll see uh, hi, hi. Hey, how are you doing today? good does anyone want to be on YouTube sure <laughs> I'm recording right now hello Say hello, YouTube. <laughs> hello, YouTube. So this is my insurance agency. Okay. I was bringing this to. Is it for Lauren? It is for Chelsea. Ooh, okay. So. All right, I'll let her know. It's All right, there. thank you. We won't tell. <laughs> See you guys later. Thank you. Yeah. All right, we got the. Duncan order for Chelsea dropped off at my insurance agent and now we're heading to another business that I've delivered too many times and this one coming up is the 850 plus. I don't expect it to go up by much. Um, this would originally have been 650 plus. It'll prob probably go up about 50 cents. So this will probably be a $9 order, which is great. Um, that'll just simply mean that we turn this into a $14.50 run for not much at all and it's leaving us on the north end of town so this is turning out to be a great run Okay, we got Cassie's order dropped off now. It was a human services office, so I thought probably not a good idea to bring the camera in. Anyway, I gotta get better about taking screenshots of those plus orders so that you guys can see the total. It was $9. Um, we got a dollar from DoorDash for the stack, and then um, the extra two dollars for peak pay which made it three and she actually tipped six dollars so thank you cassie that was a very generous tip for the short distance that i had to go okay everybody i'm here again dashing dink coming at you with some closing statements on peak pay <laughs> is it really worth it today i can tell you it was not uh we only received four offers i took them all we were only active for 42 minutes. We made $27.50.
in that 42 minutes. But we were on the app for two hours and six minutes. So in my personal opinion, for today at least, peak pay was not worth it. It brought out a lot more dashers. The orders were spread way more thin. And I just don't think it was worth it. There's peak pay again tomorrow. I don't know if I'll have an opportunity to um, get out during peak pay to dash because I've got someone coming over to look at my furnace. But, you know, it was one degree above zero Fahrenheit this morning. And I thought that that would help keep some of the dashers at home. But the roads were good. There was not a lot of wind. It wasn't snowing or sleeting or raining. And so everybody was out there. Everybody was trying to make money with the peak pay. And so for me, it was a bust. Maybe somebody else's phone was getting hit a lot harder than mine today and they made a lot of money. More power to them. I hope they did, but we did not. Um, we'll see what happens, but for right now, on the day, I've got something else I got to go and do. $27.50. Not a very good day. I hope you guys have a nice day. Thank you for subscribing, liking, sharing. Um, commenting, all that stuff. Enjoy the video, and we'll talk to you very soon. Dashing Dink, signing off.